What's up guys? I'm gonna do a Court of Stars uh, Mythic 3 and we're going for three chests on this run. I'm uh, not very confident in, uh, in this happening just because uh, of the gear but we'll see what happens when we start uh, working on the mobs and we'll see what our DPS is. I'm on a boat. Come on, come on, come on. These are my talents if you want to see them. You just pause the video. Alright, here we go. Mount up. <clears throat> it's the easiest way. Then we've got this guy. Yeah, we're probably gonna get three chests. <laughs> we're definitely gonna get three chests. Unless something goes terribly wrong. Try to get some dots out before the guy dies. Here we go, we're probably gonna sneak through here. And we're gonna go up to the sentry. Void form. We're gonna get this guard. Bunch of adds. I'm gonna throw out a stun. Don't want to stand in that, that's for sure. This should be pretty easy. There's no sanguine or anything crazy like that. It's just, you know, more damage, more health. Throw out my dots, my fiend out there, some mind blast, and mind flay. So I'm going to start with some dots, get void form going early. And on this boss I have to remember to jump when he puts a debuff on me. Not a hard boss. He also does like uh, some sort of quake and you have to get out of the way before he casts it. It's pretty, it's pretty simple as long as you're paying attention. It's easy to zone out or uh, you know, get focused on your dots. All right, here we go. Mind flay. So there's that quake thing you gotta look out for. Crush my dots for safety. So mind flay, void bolt, dot these. Uh, adds but I still want to stay on the boss as much as possible well somebody has a similar name to me and uh, and I thought it was me with the debuff for a second tripping me out there he goes runs does his thing gonna call more guards I think no this is it yes, yeah now we got to go up here and kill a I think it's a, a construct and throw a stun out just because plus I get a haste buff from my legendary there we go now we gotta run through all of these guys who apparently don't like us being here very much. I 
I think these are all like the rich elves and they don't seem to care about all the, the other guys that are suffering. That's what it seems like. This expansion was pretty political. Came about came out about the same time. Everyone was making a big deal about the 1%. I thought that was kind of ironic. Those guys died pretty quick. Died so fast I couldn't get my, uh, couldn't even get into void form. Which as you guys know is my biggest complaint about Priest is that when you get in groups with these guys doing a million DPS I can't even get into void form to start doing my major damage before everything dies. But such is the life of uh, being a daughter, I guess. I'm gonna dot all these guys up. I need to move out of that. Get some void form going, some mind blasts, refresh my dots. And I could have thrown out a stun if I wanted to, but I'm feeling kind of lazy this run. Probably shouldn't since we're doing a going for three chests, but hey, I think we'll be okay. I'm gonna throw out a stun for these whirling blades, but looks like somebody else got it, maybe. I could avoid Foreman formed on that, but it would have felt like a waste of time, I think. So where are we going? We gotta get this next captain or sentry, whatever he is. Enforcer. I always forget what they're called. This will void form. Actually be a little bit useful. There we go. And he's dead. And here's the eye. Belgar the Watchful. My fiend out. And I don't think, no, I can't stun him. Just got a DPS. Fresh my dots with void, bolt, some mind blasts, disintegration beam, disintegration. That's what that is. And we gotta go to the other side. I guess we're gonna sneak by here. I guess that worked. But we got this pad, unfortunately. It's over here in the corner. Void form and some void tort. Oh, we got some ads. Throw out a stun. Ads are always nice, gives me more time to start doing DPS, even though it's a waste of time. <laughs> to pull, we shouldn't be pulling extra. Jazz Sheru. I think that's his name. Shockwave. Mind Blast. Get some Void Form going. Void Bolt. Need to watch out for these pats here. So we don't need to kill them. I 
and Enforcer on me. And get my DPS going. I'm gonna focus on the boss to void form going. And all the ads keep dying pretty much, so I'm not too worried. It's like somebody failed to uh, not stand in something. Ouch. Gotta get these ads down. They hurt, to say the least. Refresh my dots in the boss and void form. Try to stay alive. There we go. Now I gotta get a disguise. Let's find out what kind of guy we're looking for. He's got a light colored vest. No cape. Light vest, no cape. Male, light vest, no cape. He doesn't have a light vest. Male, no light vest. That guy has a cape. Male, light vest. As a cape, and he got him. So I'll make my way to the top. That's kind of sad. I usually get him for. So here we go. We got to kill the guy and get the key. Hopefully he doesn't lock me out. <clears throat> I'll step inside. Alright. He's gonna grab the key. So we need to go to the balcony and take out the final boss. We're uh, running short on time. But I think we can do this. Open sesame. There we go. Now we gotta listen to these guys have the whole conversation. Come on. My void form is ready, that's perfect. So I'm gonna start with dots, void form right away, mind blast, get my fiend out there, and I'm gonna use void torrent while my, while my uh, stack's so well. And there's little things you gotta watch out that you're not uh, stepping these little swirly things. Sometimes they spawn on you. And some Mind Blast, some Void Bolt, and Void Form again, refresh my dots with Void Form, and Void Bolt, and some Death Words, some Mind Blast. And there we go, guys. Three chests. Gold. Uh, a waste. 350. Don't need it. 
Anyway, that was the run, guys. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.